great story to tell here at SCROC. Uh, this is what we like to call the crown jewel of career technical education. And um, SCROC has been uh, providing uh, career technical education since 1967, uh, educating uh, uh, tens of thousands of students uh, uh, over the years. And um, you know, uh, we are so proud of this program, so proud to have it in the South Bay. Uh, however, you know, we were uh, met with an unpleasant uh, surprise last year. SCROC is funded like, its own, like a, a, a separate and independent school district. Uh, it, uh, it had a line item before, uh, and that line item was, was uh, removed. We need to correct uh, the, the way um, uh, our uh, schools are, are financed so that we can continue to ensure uh, that SCROC uh, uh, continues in existence. The students come from all over the JPA boundaries to get courses they want. They're passionate. They're here because they love to work and study here and get the skills they need to go on in life and succeed. They're motivated to do their homework. They see the sense of mathematics. Why math? Why science? Why be able to read and write well and speak well? And it's all about careers. And when these students get excited, of dreaming of a career, they're excited to be in school, to be here at the SCROC, or <laughs> SoCal Rock. <laughs> I worked hard to, uh, uh, along with uh, Se Senator Ted Lieu and uh, uh, some of my other colleagues in the state legislature, to uh, get a temporary reprieve for SCROC, a, a two-year uh, funding uh, guarantee for the SCROC program. But uh, this is the first year, and next year is uh, the second year. And so, uh, clearly, the time is ticking. Uh, we need to uh, address this, uh, this challenge uh, uh, before us.